This week on Fishless Fishermen, we're not so fishless, though this one's come in one centimetre under the legal limit. Still not a bad brim for the spot. Mmm, it's beautiful. So I'll throw him back and keep trying again. See you soon. Hey, 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 mine, 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 grab it, grab it! That looks a little bit better. That's a grunter. So it's definitely not legal, but it's a much better fish. I'm gonna measure that. That's probably in the 30s, but it needs to be 38, I believe, or 40. Take a chill pill. All right, I'm gonna go get the tape. This tape measure is shit. Go this way because that's the way he is. He is 32. So not quite legal but not far off it. There might be some bigger grunter out there. You're going to have to chop him off. Yeah, we're gonna go. we're gonna turn the video off. We're gonna get the hook out of him and send him back. So I brought all the GoPro gear and then nothing out of it. Apparently, all the batteries are charged are not charged. So for anyone wondering what the new rigs are, I refuse to use anything else. These are tackle rats, ugly stick rods. Doesn't zoom in very well. Um, I've broken all my big rods. I got the zip tie and I got that left got Mara one and she's currently using the last of our mine because I don't break them. 
broke my ship. I've broken two of those. That's the last one alive. And then we've paired those with um, <clears throat> Sienna two and a half thousand reels because the original reels that came off these things were um, well, I just don't think they'll handle it. Maybe I'll um, buy another rod and I'll put one of these on it with a better line and see how we go, just out of curiosity. But no, they come off for us. Oh, and that bag is still alive, yes, although it has seen much better days. So six to eight months living in a boat and doing the shit we do, I gotta give credit to those bags. They're pretty fucking good. So we are just past Devil's Elbow off the bank. Brought the FJ down. Some bloody steep tracks here. It's fun getting in, but make sure you're gonna make sure you're gonna get out if you come down here. But it's a beautiful little spot. Plenty of mullet, plenty of brimming grunter in the water. Good way to end our Saturday. I don't know how to change camera. So for anyone wondering, we are in the middle of moving. Um, we've bought a caravan to live in. We're going to be building that up to how we need for the three of us. We're doing that to save costs because we've got a wedding coming up. Um, we're planning a big move and a trip around Australia. So, there's living in a caravan is the way to break out of the market. Oh, we're going to buy a house in there too. So, living in a caravan, cheap way of living. We're going to make it completely solar. Um, we right may now. even do a few videos on the shit that I'm, we're doing at home, not just fishing and forward driving. Yeah, well, keep you guys posted. Ruben's been working away in the Northern Territory and just he's planning trying to pay for a wedding too. So, this year's gone to shit pretty quickly. So, we're just making up. But you may get some caravan videos and shit too. We might even change the channel up a bit, see how it goes. Beavis.